What's kicking y'all? Quick Panic here and I am back in gear, don't you have no fear? Today's episode is Pokemon flavored, as you can see. And I have something very cool to open for you guys. If you don't follow my Twitch channel, I do a lot of shiny hunting. Uh, Pokemon shiny hunting. Shiny Pokemon are just different color versions of regular Pokemon. They don't do anything extra cool, they just look real pretty. And uh, they actually do this in the trading card game. The first time that it happened, I think, was... Uh, Shining Gyarados and Shining Magikarp in Neo Revelation, I think? Something to that effect. Anyway, these three booster packs are very hard to find. Um, this this blister pack I paid $300 for, just, just so you know um, how hard to find these are. I purchased this because each of these packs has a chance to, uh, to contain a Gold Star Pokemon. So the Gold Star cards are extremely hard to find. And they're very cool. I have one. Let me see if I can show you what it, what it looks like. And I I was not a very good researcher, and I did not uh, find out which which ones we can get in each of them. So this is a Gold Star Suicune. You can see that it has the Gold Star right there uh, next to its name, and this is the shiny variation of Suicune. It doesn't have its normal colors, so that makes it very cool to me because I do love shiny Pokemon. And uh, yeah, it's I think it's one in seventy two. Uh, that you can pull one, so I'm not expecting to get one out of here. But these packs are also very cool because they have EX cards. So like the first iteration of EX. Well, this is not going to be easy to open. I should have brought an adult. Oh, all right. Look how successful I... Oh my gosh. Sealed, sealed collectors are cringing right now. Um, it has EX cards in it. It also has a lot of art that I... Have not seen because um, I've gone over this before. I opened some of these old packs because I was not collecting when they came out. Um, you can see this this one came with a cool Chimchar promo. It says uh, preview. It says it's a, a preview card. And we all know that Diamond and Pearl is old. It came out when I was like in high school, like 2007 or something. And uh, so that gives you an idea of how old these packs are. These are over 10 years old, about somewhere around there. We're going to take out our Chimchar promo. Back then, they still had those freaking prongs. I think I have a coin in here. Yeah, we got a Gardevoir coin as well. Um, so anyway, the, the Gold Star Pokemon would be like best case scenario what we pull out of here. Sorry, sealed collectors. These are gone in the trash can. Um, here's our Chimchar promo. Chimchar looking heckin' cute. What? what? I was about to say, why are you not focusing? There's nothing else on here. I like the hollow foil. It's Ken Sugimori art. I I don't have I ever played. I think I've played through uh, Diamond with Chimchar, but I normally choose Turtwig. I, I like the Grass Pokemon. There's our three booster packs. We got our Gardevoir coin. There you go. Add that to my collection. Now the main event. Um, man, I don't even. What's this? There's like some sort of cardboard on here. Okay, whatever. Um, Oh, these are so expensive. <laughs> Let's start with Power Keepers. I don't know the pack trick, uh, so we're just going to go into these all willy-nilly. If you guys like these uh, packs, I actually have more coming that I got uh, last night. So that's exciting. Uh, if we strike out here, we'll have some more opportunities. So I'm just going to go at this willy-nilly. Oh, man, that's so cool. Trap Inch. We got a Sfeel with it. I love telling people to Sfeel with it instead of deal with it. We got a Cacnea. We got ourselves a Magnemite. I think the reverses in this pack are kind of cool for some reason. I, I, I just remember that. There we go. So we get a hollow. This is like our reverse. Our reverse. We got Curly and it says Power Keepers there on the card. Very cool. I don't know. Is the next one a rare? We got our, oh, we got a holo. Okay, we got Machamp Holographic. I think that's our rare. All right, so we got a holo out of the first one. It's not a gold star, but that's fine. Like I said, they're incredibly rare. I'd be very surprised if we got one. We got a Sharpedo, and that's the last card in the set. So these are really cool sets to open, because like I said, the, they don't have like reverse hollows. Reverse hollows have like the holographic on the outside. Like all of this would be holographic, but instead we get an actual holographic version of one of the cards in the set. And it has like the set name on there, which is what you see for like the pre-release cards. You know what I mean? That we get these days. So we start off with a holo. And this is a very cool holo. I like I like Ken Sugimori. You guys know that. And that's Ken Sugimori's art of Machamp. 
And it's like the alternate pose. It's not his normal just standing there pose. He's like doing a karate chop and flexing. Okay, so the first one was not a bad open at all. Let's go into Holon Phantoms now. I think the really cool gold star in Holon Phantoms is Shining Gyarados, maybe? Maybe it's not. Maybe I'm wrong. Oh, man. Woo, we got a Pichu! Okay, so this is the Delta Species Series. So Delta Species Series is when uh, the set has Pokemon that are types other than what they should be. So Pichu is normally an Electric type and a Steel type in this one. So that's pretty cool. So we got a Pichu. We got ourselves a Water Oddish. A Numel. Okay, this one's not Delta Species. You see it doesn't have that up there in the in the top. We got a Trap Inch. Oh, we got another Trap Inch. I really like Trap Inch. We got, oh, Pokemon! I've been playing Pokemon Go for what, three years now. And... I love collecting shinies, like I've said before, and I'm trying to find a freaking shiny Poochiena because he's got a blue nose and I love it. We got a full art fighting energy. That's interesting. Is that our reverse? I don't, I don't know if this is good or not. I know people like to have pretty energies. And the rare is a Kabutops. What is this? This looks so cool. Hold on, dude. Like, it's all reverse. Oh, I love Kabutops. Look at this pose. What the heck? Oh, that is such a cool card. I'm a huge fan. And we got ourselves a Combuskin. And a Holon Fossil. Dude, hold on. Wait a second. This is way cooler than getting the freaking Machamp. Look, the, so Kabutops himself is shiny. The outside is shining. What? This is so cool. No. You see this white chip at the bottom? You see that? That means this is a nine. Can you believe that? Those of you who don't grade cards, I'm a, I'm a big grader, but, uh, well, I don't even have any penny sleeves over here, so we'll just put this off to the side. We got like a big energy. I don't know if that's common, if the energy is or what. Okay, we got one more pack. If you guys enjoy opening these packs to see if we can get some gold stars, I'm trying to bring at least one of the triple pack openings a month, but I need your support. I really do. Like I said, they're $300 a piece. Um, I do this for, for pretty much for fun. So if you wouldn't mind leaving a like on the video, subscribing to the channel if you've not already, I bring vintage Pokemon, regular Pokemon, all the Pokemon content, especially when Sword and Shield comes out, I bring it to the channel all the time. So uh, yeah, your support's greatly appreciated. Let's get into this last pack. Ooh, baby. That Kabutops, man, I wish it didn't have that spec at the bottom. If I could have graded that and gotten it in a 10, that would have made me so happy. And that fighting energy, that is something. That is something. Comment section down below, do you call that a ground energy, a rock energy, or fighting energy? It's got a fist. You have to call it. You have to call it that, right? I was getting to arguments with with the... Uh, oh, these are Delta Species too. With TCG players, because like in regular Pokemon, we have fighting, ground, rock... And then in the TCG, they have like one type that means a bunch, like Psychic is also Ghost and it's also Poison, you know, you know, you know. All right, we got ourselves a Delta Species Ladybug. You're not Steel. We got a, look at that Trap Inch. We got a Trap Inch in every single pack. Hello, friend. I love his eyes. Shelder. Woo, he looks surprised. We got ourselves a Switch. We have ourselves a Pupitar. Look at that boy. We have, oh, look at that Gligar. See, I love, duh, the reverse hollows in these packs are amazing. That looks great. An electric, that's the exact opposite. He's normally ground and flying. And the rare. Woo, look at that Ampharos. What? Why are these packs so good? That looks so cool. Tell me that doesn't look cool. Ugh. Like, is that... Okay, so it's just the Pokemon that's hollow. That's so interesting. All right. We got ourselves a Steel Nidorina. A, an Electric Croconaw made of Play-Doh. Cool. Well, check these guys out. Look look at these pulls. We got, I, I guess, a hollow in every pack? I don't know. I don't know what the, the packs are comprised of. Like, the Ampharos is obviously a different kind of hollow than the Machamp. But, uh... That's pretty cool. All right, so our last pack, we got the Gligar and we got the Ampharos. Those look really cool. I'm sure people who actually know what the cards in this set are uh, are like, those are bad pulls, quick. But I think they're really cool. 
We got ourselves the Curlia and the Machamp from the first pack. And our second pack, this Kabutops, dude. I'm telling you, this Kabutops is like the coolest thing I've ever pulled. And we got that Fighting Energy, which is really fancy. I'm sure people would love to play with that in real Pokemon right now. So, uh, yeah, guys, uh, stay tuned for more content. I have some tins that I'm going to open up. And, oh, hold on, I have a Burning Shadows. I've got a Burning Shadows that I should have had on my desk. So, like I said, we're going to open a Burning Shadows uh, at the end of these videos. See if we can pull ourselves a Rainbow Charizard. Ho-Oh's on here. Well, I'm sure everybody already tuned out. They're like, well, he pulled, he didn't pull the gold star. Uh, let's, let's go ahead and see if we can. Yeah, there's your code card. Hope you enjoy that. That's gone. We got one, two, three, flip over the energy. It's electric. It's not lightning. It's electric. All right. We got ourselves a Simiseer, a Mount Lanakila, a Noctowl, who I ever love very much, a Magikarp, a Meowth, that's right, a Wimpod, Togedemar, okay, hold on. You already saw, you already saw. We got a Porygon 2 and the rare. Hoods <laughs> or Lolan Ninetales. It was worth a try. Anyway, I appreciate all the support. Like I said, leave a like on the video if you enjoyed this content. Let me let me hear you. Let me hear you in the comment section. Tell me if you like this content, because I'll keep it coming. I'll keep the, the gold star hunting coming. Like I said, I have one more three pack coming in. We'll have another shot at all these cool Pokemon cards. Oh, the Kabutops. Anyway, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. I bring content on Tuesdays and Thursdays at 4 p.m. and Sundays at 12 p.m. I try to bring some uh, some cool retro stuff uh, on Sundays. So anyway, that is all I've got for today. Follow me on Twitch. Hope you guys have an awesome day. Later.